Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning everyone and good morning Mr. Hanafi. My name is Nawidia with BP number 2010-73-2033. Alright, in this video, I will explain my understanding about compulsory reading 1 and 2, topic 5 in second language acquisition class. Okay, the first is effective filter. Okay, the effective filter hypothesis states how effective factors relate to the second language process, second language acquisition process, and it is consistent with theoretical work done in area or effective variable in and second language acquisition. Research over the last decade have confirmed that a variative relate to success in second language acquisition and there are three categories such as uh, motivation example you don't have motivation to learn a uh, second language a foreign language also you don't you cannot acquire the competence to have a second language of foreign, foreign language and the second is uh, self confidence self confidence you don't have self confidence uh, the environment don't support you and you also don't have motivation to learn about the second language or foreign language and that can be a filter that can be filter to you you cannot acquire the second language you cannot acquire the competence to about uh, foreign language and also if you have anxiety uh, the third is anxiety. You also there that's be also can be a filter. You cannot acquire the competence to second language or foreign language. Uh, the foreign filter hypothesis uh, captures the relationships be between effective variables and the and the process of second language acquisition by posting that that acquires vary with respect um, to this to this strength or level to the strength or level of their effective filter okay the uh, the example like this one this one this is you will input new learn New, new language you will learn and this is a B filter uh, that I mentioned before like motivation self-confidence and anxiety that's a B filter and you cannot you cannot uh, have language acquisition device and also you cannot acquire the competence like this one okay uh, the next one is the role role of consciousness in second language learning uh, the role of consciousness in second language learning is also probably necessary in order to resolve to resolve a number of otherwise intract intractable issues in second language uh, learning in second language acquisition learning language influences uh, consciousness also, uh, in the sense that it's historically evolved forms, specific nature like semantically and syntactic and syntactically, uh, and those thought the differentiates in his acquisition learning in in his acquisition learning hypothesis suggests that language learning is is a conscious active process teach the rules of a language rules of language whereas acquisition is a subconscious process more than more than akin more than akin how 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 to learn uh, uh how 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 person to learn a new language um, I think 
I think that's all from I think that's all from my understanding. I'm sorry for my mistakes. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.